five, four, three, two, one. Be careful. The, that? No? Yeah, just like Why? Uh, I can't say it. My eye hurts. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Don't do that. It's way too short. Poor kid. And with craft scissors. A bowl and craft scissors. I need to get it off of my nose. There's Don't no cut like. too far. Stop. Stop, 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 stop. Look. Chin up and don't cut, don't cut. Stop, 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 stop. Don't cut this You're cutting up. We're on the mm. bed. So we're about halfway done. Yeah. Can you turn to the side so we can see it? Yeah, buddy. Yeah. Looking good. Amazing. Oh, yeah. You got a lot of hair, buddy. Yeah, hey, you do. What are you looking at me for? <laughs> when I was in middle school, we used to do the bowl cut with an undercut. That was cool in the 90s. Oh, so you used to go what? No, we used to like lift it up and shave underneath the hair. I don't know how to do that, so I'm not going to do that to you. This is the bowl's cut phase two. All right, let's see around it. Turn your head. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Look this way. This way. Full circle. Oh, oh, oh. That's really hurting my eyes. <laughs> First of all, why? It's not because it's called a bowl cut. You have to put actually a bowl on top of your head. It's because it looks like a bowl. That's called a bowl cut. It's not literally a bowl on your head. I see so many people that putting something, a bowl on their head and then cutting around it. I never, 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 never saw a hairdresser cutting. Yes, maybe in 1930, 1940, I think they did that. We are 2020. I hate 2020. I hate 2020. I even hate more these bowl cuts. You cannot let your kid go to school like that. First of all, if you do a bowl cut, it's always way too short in the front and the back is way too high. You have to... This is the occipital bone. You know, this is, if you feel it here, this is the occipital bone. It has to be like there, otherwise it's, it's, it's ugly. You have to take sections. First of all, sections, put it in the front and then cut it. Always start a little longer. You can always cut a little shorter. But if it's too short, it's done. You can do nothing anymore. So always cut a little longer. Then you can correct it. Take your time. Don't say... Now I see I don't have my watch on. Where is my watch? Imagine that I have my watch on. I have 15 minutes, so I will cut my son's hair. 15 minutes, even I cannot cut in 15 minutes. I'm sure they are good people. I'm sure they are very happy. And I, they don't mean it like that. But it's really bad to cut your kid like this. Uh, was it qu quarantine time, maybe? Um, so that's possible, but there are other ways uh, to cut your hair, but this is, this, is, this is not pretty. It's not pretty. I'm sorry, it's not pretty. I'm gonna show you what it looks like now. As you can see, this is my regrowth. This is the color that they did it before. It's, it's, it's literally just like, 
a rat's tail. So I'm getting it cut on Monday and I want it all to be dyed first now so that when, it, when I get it cut, as I said in my last video, um, it will all just be ready, ready to go and perfect and I can cut off all the bits that are all dead. So I'm going to go through now what, um, what I'm going to be using. So first of all, I've got some gloves that I'm going to use. Then I've also got loads of brushes. I'm not really sure which ones I'm going to use. Pretty good How use many brushes well, do you need? One of these is a Poundland brush and one of these isn't. So I just got sachets, which are the Weller Blonder Multi Blonde Dust Free Powder Liner. Now this has anti-yellow molecules. When you bleach your hair, it strips it of all the colour and it leaves it like a yellowy orange colour tone. This is going to hopefully avoid yellows. So it's going to lift up to seven seven levels lighter, and these come in little sachets. Um, and these were, I think, a five or eight, somewhere around that line. Do you only have two sachets? Two. You don't have enough product. You know it already. And it's anti-yellow. <laughs> maybe if it's anti-yellow, maybe there's always blue powder and anti-yellow pigments inside. But if you bleach your hair, it's always yellow. Or you have to bleach it like white and you have to bleach it maybe two times but anti-yellow pigments i don't believe in that i have many brands uh, used and uh, if it says anti-yellow pigments most of the time it's more yellow uh, every time i see a new brand that says anti-yellow pigments i'm always always disappointed in the result my favorite bleach powder for the moment we are in 2020 I can say if you looked at this video in 2022, it may be another brand, but now it's Blond Me from Schwarzkopf because there is uh, some kind of Olaplex inside the bleach powder and your hair is really, really healthy uh, after the, uh, the bleach. It's really good for your hair. So for this moment, Blond Me is for me the top brand for bleaching your hair but remember 2020 i hate 2020 if you look at in five years i hope i'm maybe i'm still on youtube in five years i don't know what will happen i don't know uh, but if you are looking at this video in five years maybe there's another brand but now blow me um some cream peroxide which is what i've got here this is the 20 volume one so i mix this in with my powder bleach It's a little too thick the sections, but they are sections. Okay, so I'll turn my camera back on because to show you, I've almost done, it looks so silly, almost done half the head and I've just run out of bleach, but I've got one more back here. Only issue is I forgot to put my bonding hair strengthening thing in it. So the next one I do, I will put this in. So I mean, it's only going to be half my head that's going to have this, but at least it'll be on half. So I'm going to put that in with my next lot of bleach and then do these two sides of my hair, which should be a little bit easier because this has been an absolute nightmare to try to do. The, the sections has to be more fine. It has to be fine section. So the hair in the middle of the section also gets enough product. Okay, I'm gonna stop the camera now and then finish just this side and then I'll come back and take all the foils out. It's really blonde. But every time if you rinse out the bleach, it's more yellow than it looks every time. it's come out like as you can see it's very orangey very yellow which is why we're now going to put the toner in so i'm not going to use a whole tube of this just because there was parts under here that the bleach didn't properly get to that's why it's still orange whereas this side is a lot more white so 
probably not going to need to hold you because I'm going to go in and bleach the side again in a couple of days and so we're going to need some more toner. So it's going to be one part toner to um, 1.5 parts of the developer which is a slightly less percentage, so that would be a 6 volume. So I'm going to mix those together, put that all over my head, leave it on until I'm happy with the tone of it um, and then wash it all off and then do my deep conditioning mask. Okay, so I have got about three minutes left of keeping the toner on. It's definitely a lot less yellow and orange. You saw how yellow and orange it was before and the toner basically just reverses that. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to wash it off, wash it with regular shampoo and then use the no yellow shampoo um, which is basically like another timer. It says leave it on to one to five minutes, but the lady in the store said just for like the first time, just do it for one minute because otherwise my hair will just go purple. So I'm going to put that on for one minute, wash it off, do my regular conditioner, and then I'm going to use the second stage of the um, strengthening kit that I got, and that has to be left on for 10 minutes. So I'll jump out of the shower, put that on, um, and then hopefully it will leave my hair feeling very, very nice and conditioned. So I'm going to go jump in the shower now um, and wash it all off. So this is how I'm just going to have to leave it. It's very frustrating because the toner and like the purple purple shampoo only worked on the ends of my hair that I hadn't bleached, whereas it, nothing happened to the hair that I bleached, which is really frustrating because now I'm left with orangey yellow hair. First of all, I have to explain how toner is working. If your hair is yellow, even orange, the toner is not going to work. Your toner uh, can slightly uh, correct yellow pigments, but not if it's that yellow. And it has worked on the yellow pigments, but if you apply it on already white hair on the ends, you will tone more the ends, and again, you will have two different colors. If you have two different colors of bleach, this is yellow, this is white, you will have to apply the toner only on the yellow parts. Don't do it on the bleach part, otherwise this will be a different color again and this. You have to try to even it out. She has used 20 volumes, that was a really good thing. For me, she has to do it two times with 20 volumes, 30 minutes, and then it had to be less yellow and then tone the uh, regrowth and leave the length just like that and then it would even it out. Again, if you start with two different colors and you tone it in one piece, then it will be different. It's normal. It's not possible that the toner will see, uh, oh, this is yellow, so I will correct the yellow pigment. This is white, I will do nothing about that. Toning is not an uh, artificial intelligence. It's, uh, it's just a product. So if you have two different colors, just apply it on the yellow uh, part. Sadly, I was <laughs> going to say that my hair was blonde. I said, Okay, bitch, let's do it. I had to get it. Full precaution. I had to get it. 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 What are they doing? Shut up. I don't know. Oh, they are bleach, bleaching his hair with a toothbrush. Oh, but he's so dark. It's, it will be like a baby chicken. It will be so orange. He's so dark. It's not possible to have white hair or even nice blonde hair. If it's that dark, they, it's, oh my God, this will be so funny. Hello guys, I'm here, finally here. <laughs> oh, it's beautiful. What are they doing now? Again, bleach? More product, more product. Is it toning or bleaching? I don't understand what they are saying. It's bleaching again. Oh, 
बाद हम लोगों ने उसके बालों में ब्लैक टाई लगा दिया और और लाइक शो अस शो अस व्हाट द हेल व्हाट द हेल ओह माय गॉड दे ट्राइ टू टोन इट व्हाट डिड दे डू I don't know what they used. Did they tone his hair with 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 some kind of dark gray or dark? I don't know. It's oh my god! It's really. First of all, he was too dark to bleach his hair. It's 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 impossible. Uh, in one session, it's impossible. But did you enjoy this reaction to hair fell compilation video? Please. Give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, press that notification bell, please subscribe to my channel. Send this video to everybody you know on the social media. Of all the people that are watching my videos, only 8% is subscribed to my channel or they don't like my, my videos, that's possible, uh, or they don't subscribe. Uh, if you want to see more hair fills, if you want to see more hair tips, I'm trying to give you any hair tips so you don't make the same mistake. If you want to see other content, please put it in the comments here down below. If you want to say, hey, react on that or do that or I want to have more uh, info about that, put it in the comment. I can have new inspiration about new videos. You can follow me on Instagram and you can also follow me on TikTok. All I'm going to say today is ciao kus.